so I'm about to eat some breakfast. I made myself like a mini sandwich. I'm trying to really cut down like my portions and such. Um, so I'm going to show you guys what I have. So it's basically you got ham, pepper jack cheese, and then I have two eggs. Um, can't have enough eggs. You can have as many eggs. I love hard boiled eggs and they're just better for my body, especially with like preventing like the fatty liver and everything. So especially egg whites, that's the part that matters. But yeah, so this is my breakfast. Really trying to cut my portion size down because I don't want to be used to eating so much anymore. I feel like I've been gaining unnecessary weight for some reason. Um, so I want to do something about it. So this is what I'm doing. I'm going to just chill. I have work in like three hours, so I'm going to chill. I'm not going to study this morning. My mom was quizzing me <laughs> like crazy last night. She was reading all me through all like my physics exams and would read the question and the answer choice and I have to answer her. She was literally like, you know those memes where it's like when your parents begin to mad at you when you're younger and you get the answer wrong and it's like, if Johnny has five apples and he ate three, how many does he have left? And then you say like four and then the parents like, if Johnny had five apples, that was literally my mom. And I was like giggling. And then she was even, she was like, see, you're not even taking this serious. Da -da -da -da. I was like, mom, I love you. I love you. Thank you for, you know, calling me out because I really was laughing because I was like, Ugh. it was kind of funny. But yeah, so I just got to get ready for work. I think later on, I'm going to do a haul about some stuff that I bought. Cause like, what else am I going to find on my notes today? I'm gonna do a haul about like some stuff that I bought yesterday. I might buy more stuff today. I don't know. But yeah, let's let's get into it. Let's get into the day. It's literally 8:25 in the morning, so I'm gonna eat, take my meds, and then just start getting ready for the day. I decided to be productive and take my dog for a walk as well. So yeah, hopefully I'll be back in 15 minutes so that I can get ready for work and not feel rushed and maybe stop at CVS because I forgot to get vitamins but whatever probably not um yeah let's see I'll show you my dog she's so cute like I can't lie she's like the cutest dog but yeah I'm trying to get in at least a thousand steps before I go to work come on before I go to work um, because I want to reach my step goal, but we will see, let's see. Look at her. She loves smelling grass and flowers. Come on, love. This is her favorite walking activity, is smelling flowers. It's like the sweetest thing in the world. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. All right, <clears throat> so this portion of the video is just going to be a haul on some Christmas shopping that I did. Now, I'm under the impression that none of my family members are going to watch my uh, Vlogmas videos. And if they do, then so be it. You did it to yourself, this girl. So, to close up this video, I am just going to do a quick haul of things that I've gotten this weekend at Ulta because, yeah. So, <clears throat> to start off, so I'm going to start off with the Josie Moran Whipped uh, Argan Oil. This is the Be True Unscented. Super excited to try this. And then I also have this Exuvia's Detox Mud Treatment, which I'm excited to try, as well as this KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub um, from First Aid Beauty. I have the full size of this. I haven't used it. It's probably a better time for me to use it because I think they said to limit your like sun exposure um, unless you're using like sunscreen with this. And I got it like in the spring, summer, and I was like, ooh. It's not that I don't use sunscreen, but I'm like, okay, if I'm going to use this all on my legs, what the hell am I going to put on my legs, you know? But um, I'm excited to try, and I'll I might give this to somebody. I don't know. Ooh, everything's falling. Okay. So, the first thing that I got was this Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Space. I did get the small size because I'm very interested. Um, I'm definitely going to do a video one of these days. It's going to be a Vlogmas video. I'm trying out, like, 
all the screen makeup that I got because I think it'd be fun. Ooh, this is really pretty packaging. Um, so this will definitely be in there, so stay tuned for that. But I'm excited to try this out. I've seen a lot of great reviews on the Ulta Beauty app. Um, but yeah, I got some little uh, gifts to make a basket for someone. So this is just from the 5 for 5 section at Ulta so we have like two of the cute little hand sanitizers which I thought would really come in handy so one of them is in roasted coconut which doesn't smell that bad I really don't I'm not the biggest fan of the coconut scent so I hope whoever gets it enjoys it and it's a sweet pomegranate I don't mind this one I got two of the lip glosses which are really cute I think this lip gloss is so cute and then I got one of the eyeshadow palettes which I'm happy because the other one that they had was very like pale and dusty. And now they have this one that has a little bit more deeper shade. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch that one out because I thought that that was just better. Next, I had to re-up on my favorite concealer. This is the e.l.f. Camo Concealer. This is the matte version. Um, this is the 16 hour and it's in shade medium sand. This is what I love to use under my eyes or when I'm running low on this, I plop this in the middle of my lips when I do my ombre and boom, I have a nice nude. But this I really love for on the skin. It's so nice. It's just like Tarte Shape Tape, but for $6, literally. <clears throat> Next is gonna be another thing that I try in like a whole new, uh, new makeup video one of those coming up this is going to be the l'oreal infallible uh 24 hour fresh wear foundation uh ulta finally had it in stock so i decided to get it it's in the shade 250 radiant sand i think it should be okay if not we'll find out in the video together right but this is it i'm excited to try it out so yeah i don't really wear powdered foundation so that should really be interesting um next i got this urban skin rx uh even tone cleansing bar i'm really here's the thing i'm collecting all of these skincare products yet i fall asleep with my makeup on still i have to start taking off my makeup before i get, go to bed if i want to start these things but so this is what it looks like so i'm excited to try it i'm really thinking that like my winter break is when i'll get to really experiment with some of the skincare that I've bought over the last few months because I really underestimated like my workload I think for the semester I think even with starting vlogmas I really underestimated how much time it would take me it's not that it takes me a whole lot but I feel like all my free time should be studying and it's hard for me to not feel guilty uh when I'm not studying so that's why like there hasn't been a video for like two days and I apologize but I'm definitely gonna try because I think it's important and I really want to document myself as I'm going through school so that when I'm on the other side and I'm finished and I'm, I'm a registered stenographer I can look back and be like hey like yeah you may have been overwhelmed at the moment but it was worth it and you're so much more well educated now in anatomy and everything so another thing that i got that's been on my radar for a very very long time is going to be the love wellness ph balancing cleanser so this is a cleanser for personal hygiene it's obgyn recommended um i've been really really wanting to try this um yeah i think that these type of products are important and I also think it's important for these products to be very clean. No fragrances, no harsh ingredients that can ruin uh, that area with, it can ruin the flora and everything. You really don't want that. So I've been looking at this for a very long time. I've even talked to people who have used it. So I finally decided to get it because it was on sale. I was like, I'm going to get you now because it's like $24. I got to pay like 11 Wait, that would have been... Maybe like 13, but still, that's a great deal. It's like a lot. Next, I got some of this Lancome Long Time No Shine translucent powder. So if you've watched my channel for a while, I think I used to use I used to use this a few years ago. And I never picked it back up because I stopped wearing makeup at the time and everything just due to personal reasons. Nothing crazy. Your girl still loved makeup. But I'm really excited to try this again. Um 
I am a little bit nervous about the translucent shade. They only have two shades. I think they have translucent and another one is a deeper translucent. That would just be a little bit too deep for me. But the thing is with Lancome's uh, translucent powder is that it has a bit of a tint to it. So that's why I decided to pick it up because if it were just to be pure wet, I'd be like, yeah, okay. Casper, I don't want her to come through. But this one has a bit of a tint. So I'm definitely going to be trying that in the video where I try new... Um, products for me because I haven't used it in a while and plus I'll see what it's kind of like with the powder foundation and then lastly I'm so excited about and this will also be in that upcoming video it's the Jaclyn Cosmetics mini highlighter ah! this girl is so pretty this one is in the shade iced I don't even want to open it yet but I'm going to because I've been eyeing this for a little bit of time too and I was like let me just get the small one this is what it looks like. It looks really pinky on camera, but in person it's very like champagne-y. I don't know why it looks... Oh, can you kind of see it from the side? Yeah. I don't know why it looks that pink, but it's not. But it's super pretty. Um, I don't mind this packaging. It's plastic, but I don't mind it. Uh, but yeah, this is really cute. So that's all going to be featured in an upcoming video. I just don't know when I'll have time to film it. But yeah, so... That is it for this haul, and that is it for this video today, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are enjoying your December and this vlogmas. Um, if you're going through finals week, two weeks, like me, you got this. Take time for yourself, you know? Make sure in the midst of studying that you're focusing on yourself and you're making time for that self-care because i think that that's where all of this starts first is self-care because if you're not taking care of yourself and your mental like how do you expect to you know pass those exams like for me i know i can get super overwhelmed and then like i can really like tank um, or it's happened to me in the past where i'll just really tank because i didn't take at least five minutes to just be like hey you're okay you're good so make sure you just do those daily check-ins with yourself or if, if you need to do them hourly every two hours every three hours like however often you think you should because i think it's really important but thank you so much for watching you guys and i hope you guys have a great day and i will see you tomorrow i hope tomorrow i actually have my abdomen complete scanning final super nervous about it so i'll let you guys know how that goes tomorrow i guess i don't think i'll have my grade but i'll definitely get a feeling i'm used to these scanning exams but it's just crazy that this big exam has come so quickly um but yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow bye <laughs>